And a cruel scam is targeting people who love animals and just want the companionship of a pet. Heartbroken and out of big money, a local woman is sharing how she got caught up in an elaborate pet purchasing scam. Her family hoped getting a dog would lift their spirits during the pandemic, but instead it left them devastated and without almost $1,000. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester is live, and Hank, this, this is really a tough one. Kimberly, it certainly is. It makes you angry. I mean, this woman is heartbreaking. Her family was really hoping to get that new member of the family, a dog. Instead, they're out big money. And as you'll see, they are one of thousands of victims being targeted in pet scams during the pandemic. I saw this basset hound and I thought it was the cutest thing I ever saw. Cindy Riggin is like many people during the pandemic. She wanted to add to her family. And when she saw this dog online, she just knew that this pet was perfect for her. I really wanted the basset hound. Um, you know, it was a puppy. It was the cutest little puppy that I had ever seen. The breeders offering the animal out of North Carolina, telling Cindy the best way to pay them was using a gift card. And not only did she send one, she sent several, totaling hundreds of dollars. I went and got that, and then they, they wanted pictures front and back. They had my son register it, and then after that, uh, we waited. The breeder contacted Cindy one more time. More money was needed. This was a fee to crate the animal and to ship the animal. The animal never arrived. Then we waited and didn't hear nothing the next day. We realized that there was nothing. There was no dog. Puppy scams like this one, unfortunately, on the rise during the pandemic. The best advice, always visit the breeder in person. See the animal for yourself. And the Better Business Bureau warns, never pay with a gift card. Whenever you purchase a prepaid gift card, unfortunately, it's just like cash. You can't get that money back. And um, we're seeing that happen quite a bit. Um, with the puppy scams as well. Puppy scams were huge in 2020, and that just continues. They are ramping right back up again. That breeder was going by the name of Paradise Basset Hound out of North Carolina. We've been trying to contact them. The website has now been taken down. The phone number disconnected. Not a big shock. This, again, an important warning for buyers to always beware. We're live here tonight. Hank Winchester, help me hang. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Okay. Hank, we appreciate it.